Let's find and simplify the difference quotient for x squared plus x minus 1. The reason we do this in college algebra is so that you get used to function notation. So let's write out the original function. f of x equals x squared plus x minus 1. When I look at the difference quotient, I see that I have f of x plus h. So I need to figure that out next. So f of x plus h equals. Before I do anything, I always make parentheses where my x's are. The reason is whatever is here will be substituted in for my x's. x plus h, x plus h. My next step is to simplify. So first of all, x plus h squared is x plus h times x plus h. To figure that out, remember we need to FOIL. So we'll get x squared plus xh plus xh plus h squared. My last step is to simplify. So I'll get x squared plus 2xh plus h squared. Now I need to look up here. I need to complete the rest of f of x plus h. So x plus h squared is x squared plus 2xh plus h squared plus x plus h minus 1. Um, I can distribute my addition through or multiply by a positive 1. It doesn't matter. It's going to be the same. So I'm going to have x squared plus 2xh plus h squared plus x plus h minus 1. My last step is to simplify, but unfortunately, none of these are like terms. So f of x plus h equals this big long guy. So let's substitute that in. I'm going to write out my difference quotient first, f of x plus h minus f of x, all divided by h, and that's pretty important. So the first thing I'm going to write is f of x plus h, which happens to be right above here x squared plus 2xh plus h squared plus x plus h minus 1 minus f of x. And if we look way back up here, f of x is x squared plus x minus 1. So we'll put that in there. x squared plus x minus 1. Remember that whole thing is divided by, trying to make a straight line here, divided by h. Now when I simplify, I see this is minus f of x. So I need to distribute through my negative or my negative 1. So what I'll end up with, I'm going to start way over here again, is x squared plus 2xh plus h squared plus x, x plus h minus 1 minus x squared minus x plus 1, all divided by h. Now my next job is to simplify the top. Well, I have an x squared and an x, negative x squared. I have a positive x and a negative x, and I have a negative 1 and a positive 1. So what I have left is h squared, and I like to write these in descending order. So h squared plus 2xh plus h all over h. Now when I look up here, I have like terms. I have an h in all of this. So I'm going to factor out my h. So I'm going to have h times um, h plus 2x plus 1 divided by h. So the h's will cancel, which leaves me with h plus 2x plus 1. And that's what I would get when I simplify the difference quotient for x squared plus x minus 1.